Come join me as we check out this beautiful multi-million dollar listing in Toronto. This is Shay and Vidiata, the listing agent for the house. And I'm so excited. She's gonna take us around and show us everything. This is a magnificent estate uh, that is really one of a kind in this area that we're in, in the South Kingsway. You have the golf course, the prestigious St. George in your backyard, and you have a lot that's 288 feet deep, which you don't get too often. So here you're in the formal living room. Uh, you've got a fireplace, which you don't always get in the living room, which is a really nice feature. And you've got your windows that are look over the rear and the front garden. And going into, this is the piano room, but it is also the formal dining room. So you can um, entertain guests here. And very nice open concept layout that goes into the exquisite kitchen. This is so cool because I love that it's technically a dining room, but they've made it into a piano room and it just is very interesting and unique mm -hmm. and it sort of breaks up the space very uh, interestingly. We've got marble countertops, marble backsplash. Um, you have all high-end appliances, so you've got Miele appliances, Viking, Thermador. So if you like to cook, if you like to entertain, this is the kitchen for you. So what do we have over here? So we've got a eat-in area um, that they're using really as their dining room setup. Um, and then you've got your family room, which really functions like a great room. Beautiful that you've got that open concept. So again, if you love to be around family and friends and bringing people together, this house is laid out so that you can do that very comfortably. You've got um, access to the rear gardens off of the piano room and out of the kitchen as well. So the entertainment from here can just continue to flow into the backyard. It looks like it's just sort of some endless field, with so beautiful privacy. You've got, um, you're backing onto the first hole at St. George's uh, prestigious golf course. It's something like a two or three year member wait uh, oh, wow. to be able to even get in there. Uh, so if you are a golf lover, to be able to wake up and go walk to tee off and then walk home from the clubhouse, I mean, that's a golfer's dream right there. Is this the master? This is technically like the master wing. Oh, okay, so I already got like double doors leading into the master bedroom. After you, thank you. Let's look, let's look. Oh, is this like a steam shower sort of thing? Like what's... We've got a, it's a water closet oh. with a bidet, which you don't see too often anymore. No. Um, this view out of this bathroom is stunning. I would never know that I was in Toronto. Totally. And this tub, okay, I know everyone does this. I know everyone does this, but I have to. This is a nice bathtub, I will say. It's nice and big, too. Yes, <laughs> it, it will fit, too. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Or a lot of babies, whatever or you want. a lot of babies. <laughs> yeah. So, I love these stairs in the, like, like you said, master wing. This decor is really cool. It's a balance between old world meets new world. Yeah, yeah. Right? You've got a lot of stone, you have the beams. You have, again, you've got the amazing view off of your own private balcony. Even just like this little balcony is enough to wake up, get your, you know, scenery, get your air, and then continue on with your day. And I want to go check out bedroom number two. Ooh. So very nice layout in here. It is. Yeah. This is a beautiful room. If you're just starting a family, it's a great option for a nursery. Yes. It has a size and of course you're close to the master. So this is the uh, third bedroom and you've got a Jack and Jill that connects to the fourth bedroom. And what's really nice about these rooms is that they overlook the rear gardens. You've got lots of natural light that comes through here. Mm -hmm. And whether you've got teenagers or young kids, uh, they're generous size rooms. These are respectable size rooms. Very key. I love this. Beautiful shower. Oh, this is like just such a unique bathroom. I love how all these bedrooms have a foyer vibe. So they just feel bigger than they actually are, or they just feel more grand, I should say. So like you walk in and then the room is here. You're not just like walking into the room, you know? This is a really nice feature. Yeah, for sure. You can sit, read your book, do your homework. Mm -hmm. Right, mm -hmm. good spot for that. And then again, you've got the view, the nice view. 
Oh my god, I'm not even that tall, and like I always yeah. have to. Oh my god. <laughs> she asked if the basement was finished. I did ask, and, and the answer is yes. <laughs> in a grand way. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So all right. Okay, I'm seeing like all of my favorite things. Let's start over here. Yeah. <laughs> so this is like obviously a full blown custom home gym with like brand new stuff. I haven't been in a gym in so long. Yes, because of COVID, but also because I was pregnant. Um, but look how amazing this whole thing is. They have every machine that you could fuck. Stop. Is this like so, a yoga room? This is a little play area to occupy your children when mommy and daddy want to have a workout and not worry about them. You can throw on the TV. There was, you know, we had coloring books and all kinds of toys set up, so there's cubby holes in there for them. It's like definitely the home to bring your personal trainer to. Like, yeah. your trainer is going to love this gym. Better than probably Equinox or the gyms that they are at. Totally. Um, there's $350,000 worth of equipment in this gym. Okay, can we go around the corner? Yeah, you guys me. might think that it ends here and it doesn't. It continues along. Oh my gosh. How perfect. This is literally perfect. And then it just keeps getting better. There's a massive TV. I mm -hmm. guess this is like sort of family room, rec room, theater room yeah. vibes. Yeah. Love all the windows in this house. The view is just never gone to waste. And actually, you guys want to go take a look outside in the backyard? So this is tier one of the backyard. Oh my god. So again, this is like entertainer's dream. It Literally. is never ending on each level. Okay, so moving on to tier three. So a beautiful oversized pool. Yeah, huge. We've got salt water. Um, and then lots of room to entertain, you know, hanging out with friends. You've got um, the lounge chairs, you've got the table room. And you also have change rooms down here and an outdoor shower. So this Come opens on. up into a half court raptor colors, of course. Oh my gosh, I, literally I was joking when I was like, you know, tier one, tier two, like I was just saying it's multi-leveled, but no, this is really seriously is. like yeah. a seven tiered backyard. Yeah. I would even do like outdoor workouts on this thing. Yeah, or like, totally could do that. You know, like, I don't know, like, it's amazing. It just never ends. It's truly like an amazing backyard oasis. You try to do your, how are your back, back shots? Oh yeah, eh? <laughs> like, I know, you could just do, seriously. And then like, it just doesn't end. Then you have all this grass, all this green space. Yeah. You'll see the, the um, golfers come by here on their golf carts. Oh look, somebody's right here. So that is what a $5.3 million home in West Toronto looks like. Thank you so much to Shay and her team for showing us around. Make sure to subscribe to see what home we end up in next.